Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Today we are doing Battletech yet again and uh, we're doing a plunder. Plunder the Capellan Confederation. We're going to go half and half because why not at the end of the day. And we're going to take a... Oh, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. What I need to do is refit and take off this Ultra AC5. Thank you very much. We, You were just way overheating with that on. So we are going to smack on another heatsink. Boink, 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 boink. Five more. Have we got an Ames? No, we haven't. That's a bit of a shame. We have a TTS, we have a heat bank, we have a heat exchanger. Uh, with that last uh, AC5 off, we're actually doing really well on heat. heat. Uh, really, 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 really well. We've got a decent gyro mod. There's not much here I can see that could actually go on and make a difference, to be honest. More heat sinks, I suppose. The more heat sinks we have, the less we overheat. I suppose. Um, oh, we can put some more armor on. Let's take one more heat sink off. There we go. So yeah, if we take the heat that off, the heat bank off, we're still not overheating and. I can put on a heatsink, armor up, and that gives us still pretty good heat sinking, to be honest. And we can use the heat bank for a different mech. I'm quite happy with that. Was it you? Yeah, it's two. Yeah, you overheated ever, ever so slightly. So I'm going to put. Oh, we've got two heat exchangers in you already. We didn't really use the um, this equipment, but could we fit the the heat bank in here? Where is it? Heat bank. So if we, for instance, put the heat sink over, took that out, put the heat bank in. Oh, look at that. Much better. Much better. Maybe. Just maybe that might work. So we'll try that. I'll get it in the and everything else was A-OK, -okay, I do believe. Oh, uh, yep. That's all fine. That's all fine. We didn't change anything to that. No, we didn't. Right. Go back. Actually, how long is it going to take? Two days and one day. Uh, that would do. Let's go back and go to the contracts. And um, we'll go back to plunder again. Half and half. Right, so we have... Oh, excuse me. The Annihilator. The Ultra AC5s. The Atlas. I'm going to take probably the Bull Shark off. Because it is a capture base, but it's only four and a half skulls. So... I might fetch in the Stalker, which only has one movement. Uh, this one has one movement. And this one has one movement. And this one has one movement. Sweet, everyone has one movement. And put Ronin on there. Right, so we've got distance, and then two up close brawlers, and then another distance. That should be okay. Should be okay. Everyone's got comm systems on. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't realise that. Uh, in the head of... Right, he's got a rangefinder. But he hasn't. Oh. Rangefinder. 
Good job we noticed that, isn't it? So all those times I've been going in to battle, but hands in the cookie jar. As you arrive in the black market rendezvous, you realise too late that someone isn't right. And there's bursts of light and sight. Oh, shit, we got caught, man. Sell the information, sell the information, of, but try to warn the black market or just pay the fine. Fuck it, we'll just pay the fine because I've just got the black market back. I don't exactly want to, like, you know, lose the pirate organisation again. Black market again. What's going on? Stop. So here we go. Uh, <laughs> third time lucky. Third time lucky. Um, what was I doing? Yep, half and half. All of those four. Boom. Let's see how good we go and how good we do. Okay, so we are in a mega city again. And this is a capture base. Because uh, they want the drugs that are on offer here. <laughs> well, if they don't know your Labrador, then oh, oh, we got a, a, a seventy-ton hit already. Oh, and by the way, I say by the way, if you want to watch some other game, I am more than open to playing a different game. What do you want me to play? What would you guys and girls and everyone else like to see? I mean, this is obviously your most favourite game because uh, it has the most views. It has... Oh, what the hell was that? That's an Orion. I didn't even see the Orion there. Too busy talking to you guys. Um... Let's have a little cheeky shot on the Orion, shall we? Seems it is in the open. Yeah, look at that. It only used half of the uh, heat bar that it did last time round when we had um, no heat bank on that Atlas. So that was a pretty good uh, swap around. Headshot is in the bull shark. Ah, when we came out and went back in, is that a Warhammer in the top right corner there? Here it is. Um, I'll bet you when we went out and come back into the game, it uh, reset the Lance back to what it was originally. Never mind. We could do some major damage to this Orion because it's got no Guardian, no... Um, Evasions or anything like that, anyway. But but it has it has, uh, it has pissed off like it's gone like geez sod sod that that was a lot of uh, that was a lot of uh, missiles. But up we come, straight in the back, and it should hopefully take off some of his um, torsos. I actually took both his torsos off. He's just a walking spot now. I wonder what that 70 ton is. Right, so we've got 70 ton up in the corner there. It's uh, 80 ton there. Got the Orion here, which is the 75 ton. And you've got another 70 ton there. So we've got the um, support lance, the normal lance, the turrets, and then we've got a scout as well. So not a bad shout for taking half and half. We should get pretty decent chunk of money probably about mm, half to three quarters of a million and uh or salvage prime salvage i think uh, that so let's uh move up the atlas and finish him off please because you're their spotter at the moment um probably yeah why not should be enough to Oh, I thought it was going to make him panic out, but it didn't. Commander. I will move you up a little bit. Can't see anything else yet. And probably overkill. But fuck it, why not? Yeah, there we go. 
Make sure he's gone. Take him off the board, as we say. It's always good to take him off the board rather than keeping him on the board. Ha, as I was saying, I would more than happy be open to playing a different game if you'd want to see it. I don't know what kind of game you'd like to see. I did try the... Uh, there was only one episode of the Lamplighters League, which was another strategy game. Okay, we only gave one episode, but it's only got four views in the last two months. So, I don't think you guys really like that one. That's why I haven't carried on with that one. The Starfield one, the UC missions are now complete. So that is pretty much that part of the story of Starfield done. Um, if you want me to carry on and do another one, like another mission line, then let us know. I do have to complete the game, go round it again to come. Obviously, because you've done the UC, you can't do another house complete or faction completion because you've already completed it with a different faction. If you know what I mean, so you have to complete the game to redo with another faction. Well, hopefully you got that. Or um, we can continue with seven days, seven days to die. Um, it's entirely your choice because you guys and girls and everyone in between are the ones who watch and um well make the channel what it is basically so i will leave it in your most capable hands uh to tell us what exactly you want to do but please do you know oh it's a cat frack. i absolutely love cat fracks. If I could have a lance of cataphracts of wood, they're not the best things in the world. They are, hmm, they're just lovely. Lovely to look at. They remind me a little bit, if you look at them, they remind me a little bit of, oh, in there. I mean, look at that. Look at that. That's just, that's just style. Uh, have any of you ever played Base Crusade? Or, uh, Forms of the Warhammer. It looks like a dreadnought. I, I think it looks like a dreadnought. That's why I love it so much. And since we can see him, I'm here. we're going to come into some cover. I'm myself. I've got, I've got four evasions, so I should be in that. I should be all right. And we're going to try and do a little bit of damage on him. That's not bad, actually. That's 200 damage. As I say, he is the spoiler. So if we could get them coming basically one at a time to us, we should be okay. What is this? I reckon that is a... Um, Archer. Have a guess. We'll see it soon enough. That one there, we'll see what it is and uh, let's see if we're right. I say Archer. I don't know what you're going to say. Orders. Right, you've got easy hits. Take him down. Not bad. This oh, he's gone. He's, he's gone. Oh, sod that. I'm off. Like the other one did. So we have to reserve and we'll fetch the Annihilator up so we can see what's going on up here instead. But if we do that then these turrets are going to see us and be able to um, be able to do some damage. So, what we're going to do, I don't want to be too close to the base with that many enemies. There's no way up here. I could try and come. Try and come this way round. But then I. Sh um, they are heavy turrets as well. So they will be packing a bit of a punch. As you. Uh, as, they, as they say. Or do we just bite the biscuit and actually do it? 
How far can you sprint in? What I might do, I might do it like that actually. Oh, 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 I know what to do. I'm going to move here. No, I'm going to move here. And I'm going to catch you up with the ping, the probe. It's a Warhammer. Not an archer. So if you guessed Warhammer, you are a hundred percent right. Is that the Warhammer that was down here? Uh can we get you with it's only six percent chances of hitting? Only sixty. I'll come back this way. So you're there's still only six percent chances of hitting. But at least you're in cover. I'm gonna do that. And chuck. We've got enough resolution resolution. Resolve to increase the damage to uh, just the percentage to 80. So I'm gonna go for the right torso. Not bad. And max. I sprint you to here. I don't think anything can see you. Oh, they've got a Victor coming in. So we can see what that one is. I'm going to reserve. They've reserved. Right, I can't see the Warhammer anymore. Obviously, because we only pinged him the once. Um. Standing by. I'm going to go slightly like that. This should take some invasion away, because you've got pretty darn good accuracy anyway. Quite nice, that was like 300 damage. Don't know where he's going. Do you see him anywhere? No, you can't, but you can see you, which should hopefully take away some of his evasion again. Oh, it didn't, so that should take it. Oh, what? He still kept his evasion. Annoying. Right. Waiting for orders. In that case, then, uh, let's move you up a little bit. Roger. Everything on you. 66% chances of hitting. Uh, let's put a little bit of uh, extra onto his that side, because this has got his AC20 in it. Let's see if we can get rid of that. We do. That is top notch. Critical hit, Commander. Still keeps his evasion. How the hell does he manage to do that? Ooh. I can see two that side. We've got a Crusader. Oh, I can see the Cataphract again. Right, so I'm going to go. Because it's centre torso and it's not much, that should be enough. And so should that one. And then I'm going to put the rest in the Crusader because that hasn't been touched yet. Breaching shot should be hopefully enough to... Oh, it wasn't. There goes his PPC though, which is one of his long range weapons. I honestly thought that was going to be enough to get rid of the... Um... What's it called? Ah, oh, comes an Otsal as well. Oh. Cataphract coming in with a bit of uh, revenge there. Victor. That's what the one I was thinking of. There goes his AC20, so he can't do as much damage as he could have done before, which is good. Light damage. Holding firm. 
turrets because uh, these are all mechs. So I think that's turrets. Right. Mm, I'm going to. Oh, Jesus Christ, that Oxford's got like redonkulous uh, evasion. 90% chance of hitting, 80% chance. So I'm going to go Cataphract and Dew. This should get rid of them both. Oh, so close. Right, that's you gone. So it's just these guys that can see us now. And come back into cover. Fifty six percent chances. I'd love for these two to move first, but they're not going to, so I take this building out, these guys can see, but then they'll have somewhere to go to actually take cover. So, uh, what's the point of hitting him? Right, I'm just going to go the two AC 20s in. So, there we go, that was just enough. Uh, saves us some ammunition as well. Here comes the broken Warhammer. It's his left side is showing us, which is his less damaged side. Oh, come back into some cover. No, can't do that. Um, like that then. On to you, please. Uh, take this room sixes off, so it saves a little bit of heat because they're not got the greatest of accuracy. Damn, it took the building down behind them, so they do have some cover to get into. Is that a cataphract? Was that another cataphract? Do I just see? Catapult. Okay. Okay. Ah, I thought, uh, I thought it was the Warhammer I could see, but it's not. It is only the catapult. But that'll do. There goes another building. Oh, God. Don't need SETI demolitions, do you? SETI? City demolitions. We can do it ourselves. What one is that? Right, he can. Oh, I'm going to take this building down there because that will destroy his legs. Need to get these guys into cover and then start vigilancing them up because. Uh... Right, so I'm going to maneuver you backwards a bit if I can. Like that. 70% chances. I think I'd rather just get rid of you completely, please. Thank you very much. Most appreciated. Enemy destroyed. Um, Ready for I'm going to vigilance you up because you've got a bit of stability damage as well. And it's your right side that's taking damage left yeah left side facing Move order received. right so i'm gonna go into you and then these guys why can't i target the building i can't target the building going on there 
Right, so hopefully this will get him leg damage and him some evasion away and some basic damage as well. Uh, uh, heat is better since we've had the heat sink in. Yep, that does get rid of some of his uh, evasion. Oh, and he, he jumped back. So I can't exactly see what damage we've done to his legs. I should imagine it was uh, significant. 81% damages on the Otzel, please. Or well, 81% chances of hitting, I should say. It's quite nice, actually. He could have walked to that one little bit in front. Oh, that is a that thing's got to go. Right, so um, one bit forward, I reckon, like that, because uh, I can't sprint you into here, and hopefully that will take care of you. Yep, that's you gone. Just leaving the catapult in the background. That is the reinforcements gone. The annihilator is getting hit quite badly. That's good that you went for the bull shark. The bull shark is um, not that bad at all. So I'm going to drop you back to where the bull sharks are. I'll catch the sniper. I'm going to fetch Mr. Wells up a little bit. Acknowledged. And on to I'll take the SRM sixes off. It saves a little bit of heat. Hope that take down some of his evasion as well. Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice. That is the right torso and right arm hit. Max, I'm just going to mm, yeah, I'm gonna do it like that. It's your left side that's at risk though. I want your right side to be kind of showing more so what I might do is can't do it there can't do it there no let's do it like that let's do it like that so me there very nice it goes one of his uh LRM 20s and actually all the Crusaders back. But it's now hitting the other side of the Annihilator. Oh, 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 he's almost on knockdown. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to do, I'm going to be a little cheeky here. I'm going to go 50 50 on him and on him. So that should get rid of him and knock him down. Oh. So close. This is a knockdown, though. If it, yes, that's a knockdown. Just, literally, just. So, what we're going to do is attack this guy with. Oh, should I do half and half again? No, you should only need one on you and one on you. Or three on you, I should say, and one on you. That should do significant ish, ish enough damage. That's his upgrade of M20. So he always got now. He's got anyway. I was going to say, always got his two small lasers. So all he could be is a spotter, but he's ejected anyway. Yes, Commander. Vigilance up. And say bye bye. Roger that. Just look at that, bro. Just look at that. That's a kill. Even still, uh, heat isn't uh, rising, so I think we did right by putting the uh, the heat bank in there from this annihilator and taking the one Ultra AC5 off. Yeah. I'm going to take a turn to drop back into formation. Sink her heats. Let them come forward. What's on this year for? 
70 ton mech. What have they got that's on initiative 4? Nothing's coming up behind us, I don't think. Anyway. Standing by. Let's uh, sprint you up. And sprint you up. everyone up. Just got that, love. Just got that. I reckon that was an archer because it was just sitting there pummeling us with uh, LRMs. Um... I wonder... And you do us a little favour. Like that. And then Sniper. Oh, Mr. Wells. You can... Ah, oh, you can't reach. Can't bloody reach. Oh well, um, in that. Yeah, it was an archer. They're all medium lasers. I don't think they'll reach the large laser wheel, but I don't think the medium lasers will. So we're going to go for the archer instead. Because his LRM 20s do reach. Ready for orders. And we're going to carry on with the uh, archer there. Just so he doesn't do damage to our uh, annihilator. Carry on with the uh, barrage. Hopefully it'll take his left torso down. It does. Takes him out completely actually. That was, that was the last one. It's now just the turrets. Oh, medium lasers do reach. I didn't think they did. Right, so I'm going to vigilance you up and put you smack bang in the rubble. Everything on you, please. Right. Good job, it's 40% damage reduction with uh, the rubble and the vigilance. We can fetch in the annihilator, which should get rid of you completely. I don't want to go too close straight off the bat because I'm kind of wondering whether or not there's going to be any uh, reinforcements turn up. What I might do is just run you into the rubble. And run me into the rubble. I reached the rubble from there. Ah, oh, shit. Should have done it the other way around. Should have put... Never mind. We learn from our mistakes, don't we? So, we can see that one. So, we're going to vigilance back up again. Can we shoot you? No, we can't. We can if we move out. We can see that one and that one. What's this one got actually? PPCs. So he can't see us anyway. Heading out. What's this one got? PPCs and AC2s. Well, he can now see Mr. Wells here. That's the LRM5 from that middle turret. There's the PPCs and the AC5s. AC2, sorry, so we do need to take that one out. ASAPs. Sprint you in. I'm going to vigilance you up as well, actually, just in case anything goes wrong. I can shoot at you, please. Make sure I've got the right one. 
that's that one gold, so that is 50%. We've got one just over here. One, to, where is it? Just there, and then the other one back here. We don't know what that one is yet, obviously. So everything on you, please. Get rid of you. So close. All right, so I'm going to just reserve and give me a chance to just pop this guy completely. Like that. And then we can rush Mr. Wells in. Uh, can't quite see. Uh, looks like the facility's got a single lance defending it and confirmed turrets. Yes, we've got them heart. Well, basically, there's a one. The word of warning we have reports the base may have gun. Yep, we've got one left. Okay. So we can now see what that is. Headshot can then go. Nope, headshot can't reach. And now, though. What did it have? PPCs and lasers. So. No line of sight, so it can't hit us anyway. Which gives us the time to run in for a capture. Can I shoot you? Yes, I can. That's everything done. All we do is capture it now with a friendly unit, which is uh, Max. is really close. Uh, we'll just go done. Oh shit! There is dealing with reinforcements. Where are they? Behind us. Okay. That is fine. That's not so fine, a rear shot, but we are in a rubble anyway. Rubble on the double. Oh, there goes the Annihilator. So the Annihilator, oh, one's over there as well. So I'm going to move the Annihilator down and through. So Max, you can sprint through, bro. Get you out of the line of sight. Mr. Wells, you can sprint but that I'm going to actually vigilance you up and sprint you back this way your uh, evasion and that should keep you safe we've got Thunderbolt coming through there and a quick draw up the top there so we're going to spin these guys around And if we go for the quick draw, it is only we'll use the res, we, we'll use our precision shot from our resolve. Go for the leg because if we go for the leg, we're going to destroy the building anyway. So it should destroy his leg for a knockdown. That is the plot. Oh, we didn't destroy the building. Okay, that's not uh, exactly what I was expecting, but then one. Um, go away, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. And I'll get rid of the bloody... Well, we've got the building there. So it is glitched. Let's fire at him again. He's gone anyway. And we finally got rid of the building thing there. The building did go. That's one gone. Ready for orders. Um, on reserve. Waiting for my opening. I want to fetch you. Like that. I can take this building down because he still can't see. So if I take this building down on the next go. Actually, I might do that now because there's one there. Orders. 
I go like that. Can I see this? I can. That should be enough. Can't move you into here. can do that and vigilance up see the thunderbolt oh that's quite a lot of armor actually quite a lot of armor this just bodes well more for the uh, salvage and monies that we're going to get so we might we might even hit a million you never know. We might even hit a million pay. That's it, but we might. Uh, one of reserve. That's the other one. Is that another cataphract? I think that's another cataphract. That sounded like an AC-10 in a PPC. I think that might be another cataphract. I'm going to vigilance you up. Put you on. Oh, it's a victor. It's a bloody victor. I'm going to uh, aim for your AC20. There it is. Bye, AC20. So all you can really do now is punch us for some major damage. Or do that. And what we're going to do is try and take you down we've actually got shitloads of evasion but not if we you got no you got no evasion or anything so i'm gonna go for you instead oh look at that that is some battering right so with myself i'm gonna go 50 50 onto the building here and onto him. So I'm going to go literally 50 50. That should get all of his evasion away because it's full damage. That should literally wipe his evasion clear. This should destroy him. Leaving Mr. Wells clear. Oh, I didn't get rid of his evasion. Okay. Never mind. Not what I was expecting. Right arm first. We are on the so side. Oh, that, that will get rid of his evasion. Taking his leg away. There we go, look. I knew we'd get him. I knew we'd get him. Right, so here comes that one, which I still reckon that's a cataract. And can you hit you can hit him, so you should, will take care of this one who is chasing you down. Just like that. Another jubbly. Leaving Mr. Wells to... Hide behind the... <laughs> hide behind the building. No line of sight. We will go... Move up to here and brace. Yes, Commander. I'm going to do a little sprint so you can sit next to him and face the same direction. It is a cataphract. He went for the one that has 40% damage reduction. Damage do that for cataphracts. I do love a cataphract. That means I can get two parts, which I might be able to make another cataphract, actually. Right, so. Commander. If I move you up, you got no chance whatsoever of hitting him. So I'm just going to sprint around. Roger that. I'm going to... Try and take some of your evasion away for the other guys. Here it 
which did work. Now, Headshot can go, thank you very much for that, Mr. Wells. And I'm going to take a lovely 86% chance hit. And then we're going to have myself do exactly the same. This cataphract is just going to go bye bye. Ooh. Ooh, it survived. It survived. God knows how. I suppose when you've. Uh, oh, yeah, actually, he's, he's still got his AC 10. Um, I don't know why he did that. I don't know why he did that. Let's give Max a kill, shall we? The killing blow. Win it for us. Just like that, bruv. Just like that. We're done. Mission successful. Look at that. Poor 800,000. Like a Christmas turkey poker talking to me because we are done. I can make a Warhammer and sell it. Uh, oh, 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 look at all these cataphracts. Oh, they're catapult parts. I could take part, two parts of the cataphract and. Oh, actually. Do we get anything decent? Oh, we got a pretty good one, actually. Two gyro mods. Quantity two. Yeah, happy with that. Let's see what else we get, shall we? All right, so we've got the part of the Orion. We've got the Otsal. We've got the Quick Draw. So we can make a Warhammer, and we're really close to making a couple of more. We've got the decent SRM4s. Obviously, we've got the gyro mod because that's what we picked. And we've got two oh, half decent medium lasers. And that's about it. I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you want to see more, then smash the subscribe button. If you enjoyed what you've watched today, smash the like button. And I'll catch you in the next episode. Bye.